All right, while I'm here, Bill's towing. I just want to talk about tag axles because everybody's asked me, and I've done videos on it in the past, but I figured I'd explain it one more time. So, what we have here is a Lone Star. By the way, if anybody's interested, I have a black version of this available. But I have a Lone Star here with a 35 ton Jerdan. It's got a nice load on there, and it's got the tag axle. So, what everybody needs to understand is that tag axles do not help towing, okay, as far as the sense of towability. So, when you're dealing with wheelbase, that is from the front axle, the center of the front axle, to the center of the tandems with the tag up, that means that is your wheelbase, okay? So that is like your giant teeter-totter. So your big fat boy is over here, your fulcrum or your pivoting point is back here, and then you have the weight back here. So to keep the front end down, you need to have the fulcrum as far back as possible so that it doesn't, it doesn't pick your nose off the ground. You guys have all done it when you have heavy weight on there, your nose will start coming off, you can start feeling your steering get a little loose, whatever. Now I've had guys think that a tag axle will help or improve towing. If you drop that tag axle down, it moves the fulcrum, the pivot point, it moves it from the center of the tandems to the center of the three, so the center of the middle tire. So you lose about a foot. A foot is a big change in towing capacity. Now, I understand that there's more braking power. I understand that it improves safety, and I also understand that it helps you scale. But the disadvantage to it as far as a safety factor is that the safety is for the braking. The disadvantage is, is that with the tag down, you're making your front end lighter substantially. That's like taking a 2,000 pounds off your front axle when you move that, that fulcrum point a foot forward. So, something to know, that's why I do understand that scaling is difficult, but at the same time, you have to find out what's best for your business. So maybe buying that overweight permit is just the thing you need to do and not worry about it because this, as you can see, they have the tag up. It tows better with the tag up. Now, if you need to drop the tag, order a truck with the tag, but you lose a, lose a substantial amount of storage. This full box right here, when on a 35 ton or any, any brand, can be a complete box. It goes all the way down. And they do that on the, on the Millers, the Jordans, all of them. But if you throw a tag in there, they cut out that box and you lose all of that. So if you need more storage, sometimes a tandem is better. If you need to be going through scale houses every day, this is probably the better place to be. So just something to know. Appreciate y'all watching.